is the tour situation salmon fish talks about true or is he missing something um so obviously there's going to be limitations in tour um but there's just not been enough evidence to demonstrate that any single party can actually on a on a massive scale de-anonymize tour users so no uh there are theoretical attacks there are actually some there is some evidence that there are some governments that have some control of servers but um this is something that like we just need to see more evidence for it's the kind of thing where like it's easy to throw out claims like this and say like well this is technically possible and they could be doing this and this is probably what's happening but there are people whose full-time job it is is to protect uh, users on the tor network and they still pretty much reassure users that no it's reasonably safe these are concerns that they are aware of that we're aware of um, but ultimately let's say even if it is a concern what's your alternative there's no alternative to tor like realistically like that is kind of the best option that we have right now and so if it's not good enough then you're still doing your best but it does seem to be good enough and a lot of people behind the tour project still stand by the tour project um and a lot of experts still stand by the tour project so yeah hey there thanks for watching this tech lore clip i just wanted to say if you enjoyed this content we have many other clips on this channel that you can get subscribed to otherwise you can check out our full channel at tech lore where we talk about digital rights privacy, security, open source, Linux, and many other exciting topics to keep you safer online. We'll see you over there, and we hope you enjoyed this clip.